Hey guys, this reading is for Libra, Sun, Moon, and Rising, and it's a week in focus reading for the week beginning March the 4th. So guys, I've pulled you four cards here because we had two jump out for the um, what's coming in towards the end of the week focus. And can I just say guys, this is such an exciting spread. This is an absolute yes spread. So in the position of energies completing, transitioning, or leaving this week, we have the Nine of Cups. In your focus energy, we have the star, and for what's coming at the end of the week, we have the Nine of Pentacles and the Page of Cups. So guys, I remember in your last week's reading, um, indicated that you um, had a, a massive um, karmic uh, cycle ending and a new one beginning. Um, you also had the, the Wheel of Fortune in there. So it was really a, um, you know, a, a karmic destiny shift and things really changing up. And um, by following up in this reading, I can only say that the luck has shifted amazingly positively in your favor. So this is really, really exciting. Um, in recent past or energies completing, you've got the Nine of Cups. So Nine of Cups is honestly one of the most um, harmonious cards of the tarot deck. It's, you know, it's the wish card. And my God, like mixed with the star here, you know, decide what you want and absolutely go for it because this spread um, is, you know, wish fulfillment is on the table right here. Um, Nine of Cups is all about a sense of contentment and satisfaction and peace. Um, you know, and just knowing knowing that, um, you know, what you desire is, is absolutely within your reach and you're well on the way to that. There's also, um, you know, that just that little reminder of even though things are really going your way, just not to be, um, I guess, comfortable or complacent in that, you know, we always need to take energy, sorry, take action and keep that energy pushing forward. So the man in the card here, you know, he's really like just, you know, relishing the fruits of his labor here, but he's sitting on a wooden bench, which is just, you know, it's, it's fine to rest for five, 10 minutes, but it's not comfortable to sort of settle in. So it just shows you that, yeah, just don't, don't get too complacent about all, you know, this amazing success that you're having. Um, so the energy of the week is the star card, guys. Yes, yes, yes. Hope, you know, unexpected help coming in you're safe it's such a beautiful omen um, it's just so positive like this is definitely a yes card so and it's just surrounded by these cards of abundance you know uh, you've got your physical and material abundance here in, in the nine of pentacles you've got your you know abundance in your emotional state and feelings here so across the board this is just so so positive so, you know, you see in the, the seven small white stars in the card there, um, that indicates, you know, your your seven chakras aligning. So, you know, you're in your center, you're in your energy, you're coming into balance. Um, and it's really, it's time for your talent and potential to be released. The future looks so bright when the star card is in the reading. Um, so towards the end of the week, we've got coming in the Nine of Pentacles and the Page of Cups. So yeah, with Nine of Pentacles, luxury, abundance, opulence. Th this is what's coming in. This is the direction that you're, that you're heading in. And Page of Cups, you know, trust your intuition. You're on the right path. You know, this, this is yours. If you can stay in this, this abundance mindset. Um, Page of Cups could also indicate a, um, a person of um, water sign um, coming in to actually, you know, to help you with this, this move to come in and actually, you know, that unexpected help that will actually like help some of this uh, manifest in your life. That's what I'm trying to say, sorry. <laughs> um, yeah, it just looks so positive, guys. Like, I'm really just absolutely excited about this. So abundance all around yes all around if you're considering um, a new work opportunity or just you know even new relationship this is a yes spread so it, it shows both um, abundance on you know the inner the inner level and also the external so I say go for it and don't forget to have faith you know the star card asks us to have faith and trust in the universe and just trust that these things are yeah, they're on their way to you.
and you know don't don't forget to um yeah feel okay about sort of asking for these things to come into your life because the universe always answers so guys that's your message i can't wait to see how this goes for you so don't forget to comment and let me know how you went if this resonates and yes enjoy the amazing energy thanks guys see you next week